Hello and welcome to Soda Tasting, an online show dedicated to soda reviews and appreciation. I'm Patrick O'Keefe. This is The Wizard of Oz, Cherry Cola from Rocket Fizz, Soda Pop, and Candy Shops. The artwork on this bottle was used for covers of vinyl records from Little Golden Records, which specialized in children's music. Their releases were distributed by Simon & Schuster, who also published the Little Golden Books series of children's books at that time. Verse Music Group acquired their catalog in 2011 with plans to issue re-releases. Uh, they actually have a website. It's at littlegoldenrecords.com. So, what we have here is, again, a cherry cola. And I'm going to read the bottle here. American Cla An American classic, The Wizard of Oz, Golden Records, Follow the Yellow Brick Road song is mentioned specifically on here. Pure cane sugar made in the USA, rocketfizz.com. Licensed from VMG Golden Records, LLC. Bottled by Rock the Rocket Fizz Soda Pop and Candy Shops, LLC. P.O. Box 3663, Camarillo, California, 93011. The ingredients are carbonated water, sugar, caramel color, phosphoric acid, natural and artificial flavor. The nutrition facts are as follows. 170 calories, 25 milligrams of sodium, 43 grams of total carbohydrates, 42 of which are sugars. It's the whole story. I bought this at the Good Life Gourmet, which is a restaurant here on the Outer Banks. And again, 170 calories, caffeine free, sweetened with sugar. Just off the bat, I'm getting a real super artificial cherry, like cherry cough syrup. <sighs> yeah. Gosh, it's a cherry I've smelled before. I don't know if it's the cough syrup. It's, what the heck is it? Maybe it's just some, you know, kind of vague cherry candies I've had in the past. But it is definitely, smells very firmly artificial. I'm still trying to place that cherry flavor. I'm not sure if it was a soda that I had. You know, it's like a medicinal cherry almost though. And it's not too bad at first, but it's kind of fatiguing. Like, I'm kind of tired of it already, about halfway through the bottle of just tasting it. Yeah, it's just kind of fatiguing, get tired of it really quickly. Um, you know, even when I, even the first sip was, it's it's kind of mediocre. Obviously with cherry citrus, there's going to be, it's artificial flavoring for the most part. But there's a flavor that's more artificial, if you get my drift. And that's where this falls. It's like overly artificial. It's not just artificial cherry. It tastes really artificial cherry and not in a pleasant way. Um, so for me personally, two and a half, two out of five. I'm kind of going back and forth there. I think I'm going to put this at two out of five just because of that fatigue factor. So two out of five is my rating here. Have you ever had the Wizard of Oz Cherry Cola? If so, let me know what you think in the comments on YouTube or on SodaTasting.com. If you're on Facebook, please like Soda Tasting at Facebook.com slash SodaTasting. Thank you for watching, and as always, everything in moderation.